Hey everyone, Sun Tendagot here, bringing you back another video of Kingdom Hearts for the PlayStation 2. In the last episode, we climbed up Boogie Boogie's house. That's what I believe it is, it's his house. And we fought... Shock, Lock, and Barrel. Boogie Boogie's little minions. Little fudgers, really. And of course, I told y'all how I was when I first had my interaction with them as a kid, and how there were one of the few times where I was close to rage quitting. And of course, you all saw me, I kicked their rears nice and good for little kids. Oh gosh, I believe I just said that. Anyway, in today's episode, we'll be fighting Oogie Boogie himself. And I will admit I won't be able to do a, a whole lot of recording because in a because in, a, um, in minutes, I have to um, stop doing my recordings and have to go for streaming because I'm still doing my giveaways for Shiny Legendaries and Mythical being Shiny Zamazeta, Shiny Melmetal, Shiny Reggie Drago, and Shiny Celebi. So I have to do that within a few minutes. And then after all that's done, I will come back here, do a bit more recording for Kingdom Hearts because the um, the original plan was to have. This was from last week, by the way. Because right now it is April twentieth, so during so during April thirteenth through seventeenth, I was trying to get to the. Uh, the next world after this one and try to get as much as I can done there. The plan did not go go out so well. But I get like a whole bunch of recording done. That's what I wanted to do was have enough recording done. Oh my gosh, Donald, you're missing half your body. Oh man. Hey, okay, like I said, I'm glad I got some recording done for Kingdom Hearts and I will probably be Oh wow, level up. And I just got my eight. Okay, before you say anything else, no, I did not do any off street training. I just put on the um, Ray of Light equipment on. And that's basically what I did. See ya! Here! Thunder! I have to drop an item. Look out below! Holy comment air. And because of that, I had to fight off these Frostosh Gang Nibbit spooky hardware. Why not right now? My throat is kind of hurting a bit. I don't know if I'm sick or not, but I think probably after a few recordings, I'll probably let the voice rest for a bit. Also, after the stream. But I'll see how I, how I start feeling. Feeling, uh, I think it's just annoying throat. Throw now like an actual sickness. I could be wrong though. Let's see how well does my Yes, my drink is actually a little spicy because I put some um, G fuel in there from. Uh, Try it again because I put some G fuel um, in my water so that way I can have some energy. I basically kind of use it for recording and walking my dog. And yeah, it kind of works. It helps me kind of stay awake for a bit so that way I can get things done. I don't really drink it that much. I might, I only really need it when I eat. Gosh, stop. Stop it. Stop it. You need to be bumped. You need to be bumped. I swear I'm about to die. Also, whoo me! There's been drama, a lot of drama lately on YouTube. 
thanks to, um, I mentioned before, called, the guy called Quan Tu Mi. You're basically seeing an image of him right now. He has been... He just will not stop. Ever since his review of Elder Ring. And again, I give no care for his opinion on Elder Ring, because that's his opinion. But it's what he said during the Elder Ring review. Telling the... Telling the, um, the Elder Ring community to go axe themselves. And in case you don't know what I mean, I mean kill yourself. Shoot yourself. Cut your head off. Like, kill yourself any way you want. That's what he's been doing. Especially towards gay people or any, um... Future me, just in case. Put the actual name on there. The LBGT community. Once again, thank you, Future Me, for putting the rightful word on there if I got the words wrong. He has gone... He is so stupid. He is dumb as heck. What are you doing, Quantum? You keep bur burying yourself even deeper. And the fact is, every time proof is being thrown at you, you refuse to admit it. Are you covering your eyes? Did you staple your eyes together? Did you, did someone, did your wife sew your eyes so that way you can't see the proof? My gosh, Quantum. Get over it. Move on. Especially now what you did. You went after the Act Man. I never heard him be after, before I, <coughs> try again. I never even heard of Act Man at, before I tried to watch um, Review Tech USA's video from that from yesterday. And Ackman has like 1 million pl I think like 1 million 35 5,000 K subscribers. And you go off and false. And that's what he does, folks. Quam TV is just like Donald Trump. He refuses to admit when he's wrong. Just like Trump. He pretends that he doesn't have any mistakes, that he's perfect, when he's clearly doing his wrong. And you go off and false flag a larger YouTuber than Review Tech USA? What's next, Quantum? If Angry Joe talks about you, are you going to do that to him if he has more subscribers than Ackman? I wouldn't be surprised if you do that. You're just going to be, you just even dug your grave towards the towards the center of the earth. And yes, I am making a video about him. I, I've been waiting to see if anything else happens and now that this happens, I have stuff to put in my text. Okay, so what's been going on? Well, why does he do It's because of fair use. He has no clue how fair use works. Also, I'm gonna go ahead and do the boogie cutscene. I'll be right back. Boogie, boogie, give me back the heart. You want it? Well, then come on over and get it! Ah! <laughs> now, let's see if I can get their attention. Oh, hello! This is it. Nobody disrespects me. I mean. I kind of brought that upon himself. So this is going to be directly Oogie Boogie's boss part. And he's pretty much a, a gambler boss. That's how, that's how the way it works. So what you want to do first is, of course, take out the Heartless. That way they're not in the way. Calm down! What? You want to play that way? There, you got what you deserve. Okay, now what you want to do is fall around Oogie Boogie, get him under, well, whatever. 
whatever part of Bunt he's on. Basically just follow him around. Around so that way you can trap him. Wait, can I use my magic on him? Oh, I can. Oh, not that much, though. Oh wow, no, looks like I'm the only one that's going to be hitting him. And yes, Boogie actually does try to use his physical attacks on him. Yeah, that's, this is kind of, uh, kind of like the, this is kind of like his boss fight. Yeah, the thing I'm actually looking... Okay, also, he's gonna try to get you confused. That's what he's gonna try to do. I'm sorry I'm not doing like, a whole lot of explaining how he works. Especially because I keep on um, kicking his rear. I'm gonna die. You what? Thunder! 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 Wow. All I need to do is that. This is actually quite a disturbing scene, actually. After all, you attain the Holy Cricket, or Krillet, whatever it's called. Attain Answers Report 7. Oh, you think the boss fight's over? Watch this. How did he get so big? Looks like it's brimming with the power of darkness. Oogie Boogie is drawing power from those dark lobes. So, we just have to destroy those things, right? And there's your phase two of Oogie Boogie's boss fight. You have to now destroy the, those dark lobe, those dark pimples. Yeah, that's basically what I'm gonna call it, dark pimples. Oh, gosh, he can do major damage. Oh, by the way, you see those treasure chests under there? You can't get those yet. You have to first beat the boss. And yes, I'm serious, too. Okay, we have our first little temple. Come on, go little go. Go. Temple. Thankfully, that's a close off one. Oh, well, um, okay, another thing you have to do is be very careful. That's a way to think. Okay, yep. I gotta get to that one. Some of these pebbles can actually be um, a little annoying to find all that tech from destroying that fire. Some of these tech points can actually uh, tech points. Um, some of these dark pimples can actually be uh, annoying to find. 
Like, that can be kind of hit real well if you're not looking. Yeah! Oh, frame rate. Usually you can probably might have to take like a few tracks. Come on, come on, camera. Gotta be careful like last time. Let's see, is this the final pimple? Ah, per usual. Heartless are trying to defend it. Nope. That means there's another one somewhere. Back to the bomb we go, at least. Thankfully, the Heartless drops so many good MP balls. At least some more bigger versions. And heck, if you want to, like, do some grinding in haste, there's a good place for it. There it is. Let's see. Is this the final temple? Also, I just now realized that the temple is also... Oh, that well, was right. It was the last one. Also, I like how the temples kind of were spewing out the fire a bit. the keyhole was underneath his house the whole time. He attained the power of stars. Gravity has been upgraded to Gravia. Or Graveria, whatever it's called. Sally, why didn't I listen to you? Don't feel bad, Jack. We'll come up with another plan for Halloween. Next time, we'll do it together. I guess we have no choice. We'll have to cancel the Heartless Halloween Festival for now. Here. I want you to have this. You attain the pumpkin head keychain. Visit us anytime, Sora. Next year's Halloween will be the scariest ever. Emotion memory. We put all the necessary ingredients. What else do you need to make a hot? What is a hot anyway? I can't figure it out. Well, that's because the heart is filled with all kinds of emotions. Happiness, sadness, angry. Like, all of those emotions is what makes a heart. My artificial heart should have been a huge success. But it was a huge failure. I can't figure out what went wrong. Yeah, by the way, the heart thing is no longer going to appear, but I do like it how they brought the heart back from Kingdom Hearts 2. I'm a little amazed though that Dr. Fingelstein kept it. Now, of course, before we get the heck out of here, we're going to go back to the Oogie Manor. Basically, Oogie Boogie's house that is now destroyed and it's no longer there. If you remember... Underneath his feet, 
there were some treasure chests. Fire! Gosh dang it. Camera. I'm curious if a lot of people are getting tired of me constantly talking about the camera. Or at least like mentioning it like once in a while. Transition's gone now. That was one of my favorite ones, too. Oh, yeah. The pumpkin key. Has a long reach and the ability to deal a string of critical blows. Oh, well, heck yes. Sign me up. Yeah, I do lose a bit on MP, but... At least I still have my 7 MP bar because of the, uh... Because of the ray of light. Whee! Oh, wait. Oh, wait. I don't know what I'm thinking of, I think. Isn't there a training mark here that only a file mix? Well, then again, I don't see the treasure chest, so it's probably a file mix only. So here are some of the chests. Maintain a mithril shell.
Go away. Boy, that's gonna be a reference in 358 over two days. So yeah, there's now really nothing else for us to do. I'm just gonna go ahead and get out of here then. Okay, yeah then. That's it then. Okay. So what I'm gonna do actually is not go here, but I'm actually gonna go back. 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 My gosh. I'm actually gonna go back to Olympus Coliseum to see if I can beat uh, the Pegasus quest again, because now I am a bit more stronger than usual. And we'll see how well things do. Next time on Kingdom Hearts for the PlayStation 2. We're going to be going back to Olympus Coliseum and see if we can beat the Pegasus Cup by ourselves. Maybe, hopefully. And then we're going to go back to Halloween Town. Not like going into it, but going back to it. And then going off to the New World. If you enjoyed today's episode, please share, like, subscribe if you want to. And I'll see you all for another episode. Peace.